Many people who suffer from infertility want very much to find a cure. There are certain conditions that cause infertility that are in fact curable, some are not. The cure would depend on the condition being considered. For example, in cases in which a woman might have completely blocked fallopian tubes as a result perhaps of a prior infection, surgical treatment might be used to clear the fallopian tubes and allow sperm and eggs to meet. In cases in which the fallopian tubes cannot be repaired, we can bypass those fallopian tubes and do in vitro fertilization, where the eggs are removed from the ovaries, fertilized outside the body, and the embryos transferred back into the uterus, not requiring the fallopian tubes at all. There are also cases of ovulation dysfunction, which are perhaps curable in many cases. Ovulation induction medications are often used to induce regular ovulatory events giving that couple a greater chance of conceiving in any particular cycle. In many cases, women only ovulate in three or four cycles per year. It's important that we improve the frequency of ovulation. If we can get a woman to ovulate in eight, nine, 10, or even 12 cycles per year, then the chances of conceiving in that time span improve dramatically. Other curable causes of infertility include certain uterine abnormalities, including mild scar tissue, or fibroid tumors, or even certain ovarian cysts. Some causes, however, are not so curable. For example, in many women, their egg number has decreased so precipitously and to such a low level that they're no longer capable of conceiving. In those cases, we would have to consider the possibility of using egg donation, in which we find a young donor that is to the couple's liking, and we then take the eggs from the donor by in vitro fertilization fertilize it with the partner's sperm, and transfer those embryos back into the woman's uterus. Just because a woman doesn't have eggs doesn't mean she's not capable of carrying a pregnancy to full term and a very healthy pregnancy. And that would give the woman who has no eggs or very poor eggs the opportunity to become a birth mother. So there are definitely curable and not curable causes of infertility. It is very important that women who reach their mid-30s and are having trouble conceiving see the fertility specialist right away. Time is very important. Fertility in a woman 35 is much greater than it is in a woman 38 or 39.